Welcome to Jamila, Algeria. Behind me, the most preserved Roman city over North Africa. So the city was named Kwikul. That means the foot of the mountain. This temple was built in 229 AD. This is the phallus as a symbol of the prostitution activity. This is the main entry for the brothel. This is the market for food. It contains 18 shops. Those stalls are shops. There is different volumes, and this is to measure lengths. I've seen a lot of Roman ruins, from Lebanon to Jordan to Rome, so to be honest, I was kind of hesitant to visit this site in Algeria. But I kid you not, these are the best ruins I've ever seen and one of the most enjoyable travel experiences I've had in a while. And I just can't believe we have this entire ancient town to ourselves right now. If this was in Italy, that Colosseum, you can't even walk in. There's too many people, but here, there's nobody except for me and my guide. Yes. <laughs> oh. Literally, I saw only two visitors after an hour walking around this UNESCO World Heritage Site. This is the main square. Whoa, it's big. The word Jamila translates to beautiful in Arabic, and that's the best word to describe this unbelievable place I'm seeing. Colon colonial. Yeah, col colonia. Beginning in the first century AD, the Romans constructed this city which contains temples, theaters, baths, and markets built together in harmony with the scenic mountains. As you notice, there are mountains, forests, rivers, and the city is hidden. On my left is uh, one of the most authentic or the most preserved baptistries over North Africa. You have the keys to go inside? Yeah, I have the key. <laughs> I think you built it. <laughs> I'm the bishop. <laughs> Inscription? Yeah, give me give me the bottle. I need to mm -hmm. Yeah, inscription here. That means one day every pagan must be submerged here. And to make a natural light for this building, they made those frames mm -hmm. yeah, for the natural light. During its peak, about 15,000 people lived in this city, and remarkably, every single ruin that you see today is 100% original. Everything uh, is made from this? Yeah, limestone. Where did they get it from? From that summit. So they picked it up there and then they brought yeah, it here? Yeah, of course, the safes. I'm completely shocked and stunned by how unknown it is, but I guess it's just one more reason to love Algeria. Oh man, what an experience this has been. Ranks up there with one of the coolest things I've done. It's just there's nobody around. I mean, you have this whole place to yourself, and I can't think of a better place to see some ancient Roman ruins than right here in northern Algeria. Guys, put this country on your list. There is a lot to see, a lot to do, and God, I'm at a loss for words. I'm just stunned. See you guys. I'm Drew Binsky, and if you like my travel videos, please click subscribe and join me as I plan to visit every country in the world.